I'm back at it again with another video. If you guys don't follow me on my Instagram, make sure to go do that. Got my Starbucks. Just get into the video, get into the styling. These are the things you're gonna need. You're gonna need a brush. You're gonna need some um, bobby pins. And you might need this comb. So I'm gonna take this out like this. Take all my hair out first. Brush. Do what you need to do. The first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna straighten the bottom of it because we just want to make sure that everything is straight and so I'm going to take the hair with my brush and follow it down right now no curl like just straighten it that's all you have to do just straighten it because we have to soften up the hair because the hair to remind you it's soft but like it's curly at the same time see how it's like curly you get what I'm saying so like you have to make sure that everything is good. Okay guys, so as you guys can see, I straightened it. I straightened all of these inches. Honestly, like, it didn't take as long as I would thought it would take. And then I'm just gonna come, uh, gosh. Repeat it on the rest of my hair. Um, and then I'm just gonna. Yeah, that's really it. Just call it that. Like, this is what I usually do, like, when I go to school or something, for an example. Or, like, um, just on a daily basis. And this is where the comb comes in. So when I was saying to you guys to have this comb at all times because you really, really want that dramatic, that's when you take this comb and you comb through it. You want to wait to do this step when your curls have cooled down. Don't brush through it when your curls are hot because you're going to literally comb it right out. My curls are cool because cool, they were sitting in those little wrap things. And then I'm just going to take my side here where these curls are. Then I'm going to part it in the middle. What the? Part it in the middle. Let me sit up for you guys. Part it in the middle like this. Anyways, um, yeah, this is what I did. If you want, like, with your wigs, normally what I do is I spray got to be, but I just wash this wig, so I don't necessarily want to put got to be glue in the wig because, um, it's just a whole lot going on. It really is. Um, but no, I really, really like this. Like, I think it's cute. I think. It's like a nice thing to do like if you're going to an event or going on the go. It's just something simple, simple that I decided to do. I really like doing these hair videos and I definitely am going to do more of them. And especially with this wig because I'm just feeling it. And um, I'm going to be getting new wigs and stuff like that coming in. So I'll be showing you how to install those and style those as well. But I'm a person where girl 
when I buy a wig or if I buy something, I'm gonna wear it out. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm gonna wear this wig until I can't wear it no more. Because, like, frontals, us frontal girls, you know for a fact, like, frontals are not cheap. They're not like, just like $20. You know what I'm saying? That you can just go get, depending on the frontal that you get. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and also comment down below any video ideas, hair videos, anything that you want to see, videos, period. Go follow my socials or whatever. This is it, and uh, peace. Baby,